o'clock news on channel 9. Tonight we have doo -doo 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 -doo, breaking news. The bubonic plague is struck again. Farnsworth, tell us about what is happening. Over 1 million people have been reported dead in Europe from bubonic plague. In other news, Blockbuster stocks are up 39%. Also, Mr. Matthias was awarded Teacher of the Year. This has been his fifth consecutive year he has won the award. Now to Alex DeVecchio with the main story. Hi, Billy. Today I have Dr. Pepper here in the studio. He's here to tell us about the symptoms and warning signs of the bubonic plague. Thanks for being here, Doctor. Glad to be here with you, Alex. Doctor, what would you say is the biggest warning sign of this horrible illness? The first sign of the bubonic plague are fever, trembling, weakness, and profuse sweating. Well, it's good to know. Can you tell me a little bit more about the symptoms that develop after the disease progresses? After the first sign, smooth, swollen, painful glands, lymph glands appear called buboes. We know the survival rate is low, so why is it that so many people are dying from the plague? Because climate suddenly got colder, the world was in the midst of a long war and famine, and urbanization promoted the spread of the disease. Are there any alternative medical treatments for the sickness? Currently, one of the most popular treatments are slant buboes and applying a warm mixture of butter, onion, and garlic. However, some home remedies include using arsenic, lily root, and even dried toad. All right, doctor, thanks for all your help from information. And remember, if you have any of these symptoms or see them on anyone else, get help right away. Back to you, Billy. Okay, thanks, Alex. This just in. We have a live report with a victim with this disease. Over to Mr. Lin, Channel 9 field reporter. Go. I'm here at the home of Mr. Sigmund. Thanks for spending some time with us. You're welcome. <coughs> <coughs> so, could you tell me, when did you start feeling sick? About two or three days ago, I started getting these bumps on my body. Hmm. Do you have any idea how you got this disease? Um, well, I started getting rats in my house a few weeks ago. They might be the cause, but I also have a lot of flea bites. Hmm, that's interesting. These spots, do they hurt? Yes, yes they do. They just appear out of nowhere. I see like this one on my hand. Hmm. Okay, we've had experts talk to us end up. Do you okay. want the good news or the bad news first? Surprise, man. Well, hmm, you're going to Dyson. Have what? Great. That's just what I need. I'm, I'm the only one in my family. Great. Everyone else is dead. What could possibly be the good news? Uh, mm, that was the good news. Great. You shouldn't just leave me alone now. I'm going to die in peace. Okay, um, um, and uh, on that note, uh, back to Bill with the weather.